Hello friends, welcome to Bright Scholarship official channel. Today we are going to talk about the SIIT Graduate Scholarship Program. So before starting our video, please subscribe our Bright Scholarship channel and click the bell icon to get latest updates of our channel. So let's talk about the SIIT Graduate Scholarship. The SIIT Graduate Scholarship is a fully funded scholarship program for international students. No application fee required for this scholarship. No IELTS test required for this scholarship. This scholarship program is offered for master's and PhD degree level students. So let's discuss about the details of SIIT graduate scholarship. This scholarship is a fully funded scholarship for international students and uh, this scholarship is available in Thailand. So last day to apply for this scholarship is 15th of March 2022. Now let's, uh, let's move towards the financial benefits. SIIT graduate scholarship covers all expenses like complete tuition and educational support fee, living allowance, visa fee, airport taxes, round trip airfare tickets, health and accident insurance will be provided during the scholarship. Uh, so let's talk about the list of available study fields. Mechanical Engineering, Chemical Engineering, Civil Engineering, Computer Engineering, Electrical Engineering, Energy uh, Technology Management, Engineering Management, Information and Communication Technology for Embedded Systems, Digital Engineering, Environmental Engineering, Science Technology and Management, Industrial Engineering and Logistic Management, Information Technology, Biochemical Engineering and Biochemistry, Management Technology, Engineering Management, Logistic and Supply Chain System Engineering, uh, material engineering science and technology so let's talk about the required documents for this scholarship a statement of purpose a curriculum vitae uh, or uh, cv or resume an official transcript or current transcript for master's degree uh, you must have bachelor's transcript with at least 2.75 gpa uh, for phd degree level Bachelor's degree transcript and master's degree transcript with GPA of 3.50, certificate of English proficiency test, and uh, uh, which includes TOEFL, uh, IELTS test, TU and uh, G TU GET test, and uh, citizen uh, citi uh, citizen ID card or passport research paper, uh, publication or certificate if any, recent photograph. The applicant can apply for the online application even though there is no any proficiency, uh, there is no any certificate of proficiency test. Eligibility criteria. To be eligible or apply for this scholarship, applicant need to fulfill the following criteria. So that means all the students wanted to be a part of this scholarship must fulfill the eligibility criteria. So not a Thai citizen or do not hold Thai nationality. Must be excellent in previous academic records. Two strong recommendations uh, have good health and good conduct not receiving any other scholarship. Uh, last day to apply for this scholarship is 15th of March. 2022 and the result will be announced on 20th May 2022. So here is the application deadline. Uh, so uh, here is the procedure for apply, applying. First of all, we check official link. So here is the official link. Uh, uh, you can read these details and can understand by reading it carefully. Now let's move towards the previous page from where we can apply. Uh, by clicking on apply now button, we will move towards this registration page. So first of all, we have to register. Uh, this is registration fee. Uh, this is registration form first of all title miss saba first name and last name is 
citizen id date of birth Uh, age 21 country pakistan so nationality address Pakistan mobile number female id so register Uh, then you confirm agree to the information so here is the application form by clicking on click here to apply you will move towards application form so level let's suppose masters of engineering program program manage uh, research of interest let's suppose biomedical engineering uh, potential siit advisor 1 2 and 3 english proficiency uh, writing let's suppose good and speaking let's suppose fair if you have given a english proficiency test then you have to select let's suppose you select ielts then you also enter your scores and test date and if you don't uh, taken a test then not yet taken medical status uh, let's suppose uh, you summarize your health and medical history uh, but in a 50 words financial support if not granted a scholarship do you have any financial support for your study at siit if yes then click on yes and name then uh, if no then click on no statement of purpose require application uh, application documents let's suppose uh, statement of purpose is cv bachelor's degree official transcript or master's degree id card recent photograph uh, ielts test if any but recommended if you have this uh, then you have to upload or if you don't have then no problem refer one you have to uh, write refer name refer name let's suppose sana affiliation one uh, gmail you have to write your refers gmail okay now again let's suppose ikra okay affiliation and submit if you like this video then kindly subscribe our channel and click the bell icon to get latest updates of our channel